Welcome back to another video. Today is Friday, February 3rd. I don't really have too many plans this weekend because it's really, really cold. And I did a lot last week, so I'm kind of just taking it easy and just chilling. But I just went and got a Friday croissant, so I'm gonna enjoy that. Tomorrow I am going to get Botox and then I'm going out to dinner with my best friend, April. Um, this restaurant, Baba Cool, invited me in. I'm really excited to try it. It looks amazing. And then that's really it for the weekend. Today I'm going to view an apartment. Um, it looks decent. I'm not sure if I'll like it, but I just need to like see what's out there. I will not be staying in this apartment. Everyone asks me for an apartment tour. Like, this is it. You're looking at it. And then there's my couch over there. But... I need some more space and I need sunlight. Yeah, I'm gonna go look at some apartments and just see what's out there. And I'm excited. Those are the plans for the weekend. Um, and thanks for joining. Also wanna do a little unboxing moment. I bought myself a pair of sneakers, um, a pair of New Balances from my Teresa. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Uh, these are New Balance 2002R. And I don't know the exact color name of these, but they have like the little bit of leather. Damn, these are good. These will be my new gym and walking around the city sneaker. So I'm excited. I went to go see that apartment and I actually really liked it. It was fucking huge. And it was a one bedroom, so the kitchen was a little funky, but I don't really need a good kitchen. As long as it has a working stove and a fridge, like, it's fine. There was counter space though, which I don't have now. I am cleaning my apartment. I like to clean on Fridays, like before the weekend, so that on Sunday I can just do absolutely nothing. So I'm cleaning my apartment now, and then I'm going to go through my closets. And by the time this is up, um, all my stuff will already be up on Depop, but um, I do this every once in a while. I clean up my closets and sell stuff on Depop. Closet has been cleaned out and I have to take pictures of all of this, list all of it. This is stuff I'm going to donate. Those shoes I'm all going to sell. I don't wear Converse anymore and I don't think that I'm ever going to go back and I have three pairs. And those are all of my clothes that I need to refold and put back um, into my closet. So I spent the whole afternoon cleaning out my closets, listing stuff on Depop and organizing my closet. So I'm feeling pretty good about that. We're all nice and organized and folded in here. And this is all stuff that I listed on Depop and pretty much all of this has sold already. And now I am making some pasta for dinner. The best crushed tomatoes ever. Some Partana olive oil. Saturday, February 4th. I just woke up, or I woke up like an hour ago, but I just got up and did my skincare. I have this fucking massive pimple and it really hurts. We are going to make some matcha and I'm so excited because I have a new matcha to try. So let's go. I got this matcha from Ipoto. Um, I got it on Amazon. Goldie just sent me a new matcha whisk, which, perfect timing, I desperately needed a new one, mine's falling apart. 
I went to go see two apartments. They sucked. Um, so I am eating a quick lunch now and then I'm gonna go back to the one that I saw yesterday. I just want to check it out again and I didn't get to see the laundry in the building so I'm gonna go do that um, and I also just want to see the sunlight situation in the afternoon um, to see if it gets any direct sunlight because it's facing west I believe. So gonna go check that out again. It is so fucking cold and bundled up but I just went back to the apartment just to go look at it again and now I don't really know how I feel. There was not much sunlight and that is like a huge thing with my apartment besides the fact that it's on a fucking fifth floor walk up. It gets absolutely no direct sunlight. So I don't know. I feel like I need to make a decision soon. I don't know. Why is this so hard? I thought I was just recording for so long and I wasn't, so that's good. But I was talking about my makeup. I used a bunch of new Merit products and I really, really like them. Um, I've used their mascara and brow gel before, um, but I used the blush and lipstick and I really like. Um, I was also complaining about how I don't really like my outfit, but I don't care and I just want to be warm because it's fucking freezing i have this in like another color maybe i'll change okay i actually changed into this oh my goodness don't look at that pile of laundry i also have a bruise on my forehead from botox um i do bruise very easily so that'll go away but i changed into this shitty old zara sweater because it's just so comfy and i want to be comfy was so good really cute restaurant I'm so glad that they invited me in and I feel so grateful that like I even get to do that but it was so nice and they really just like let you take your time there which I love um, I hate when restaurants just like rush you out but we were there for quite some time got some tastings of wine got a dessert that was really good but the food was amazing um, so definitely go check out Baba Cool if you are in Brooklyn. Um, but usually after dinner, I'm like so down to go get a drink somewhere else, still go out. But it's just so fucking cold. So all I want to do is just go to bed. So I'm going to take my makeup off, do some skincare, and get into bed. It's literally 10.15 on a Saturday night, but I'm ready. I'm using the True Botanicals Cleansing Balm. Um, it's pretty good. Recently, I've been using the Skin Fix Foaming Oil Cleanser. Literally the best face wash that I've ever used in my entire life. I would use this as a double cleanse. But I am running out of it. And want to save that for the shower. I'm actually really not liking this oil cleanser. It kind of leaves a weird film. But next I'm using the CeraVe Acne Foaming Cream Cleanser with 4% uh, benzoyl peroxide. I love this stuff. I usually dry my face with a paper towel or a clean Towel. I don't have any clean towels at the moment, so paper towels it is. After I dry my face, I wet it again with just this Aven um, water because you always need to apply hyaluronic acid to damp the skin. 
I'm sure I've mentioned this before, but this is the Youth to the People Triple Peptide and Cactus Oasis Serum. I have gone through like five or six bottles of this. It is the best hyaluronic acid serum I will ever use in my life. Just because I've been out in the cold all day, I'm going to use the Crave Beauty Great Barrier Relief. I've been using this for years and I love it and it's just so soothing when your skin is like super dry. And then my favorite moisturizer of all time is the Dew Instant Angel. Another product that I've gone through a million of these. It's so good. It's the best moisturizer ever. And that is my skincare routine. Happy Sunday. I took a nice long walk in Central Park with my sister this morning. And now I'm going to lunch with my friend Alexis. We're going to Quality Eats. Literally my favorite burger in the city. I'm just like in the mood for a burger. And I really want to drink. So heading to Quality Eats. I am wearing my favorite coat from Mango. I have been wearing this nonstop. It's just so good. Um, a sporty and rich sweater, vintage Levi's, and loafers, and my St. Laurent sunnies. Everybody lives. People on the train. You want to shake a hand and learn somebody's name. I want to get to know you, but it's hard. I, I figured I would continue this into Monday because I'm not exactly sure how much I filmed but I'm going to meet with a broker right now to go look at some apartments um, it's beautiful out and I've never worked with a broker before but I have to move soon and I don't know I have to figure something out I've had quite the day I'm just sitting on my floor because I am so tired I saw so many apartments today I was with the broker for like two hours I didn't like any of them um, and then I went to look at two apartments that I found on Street Easy. One of them is like a little bit out of my price range so I wasn't going to go look at it and then I was right over there so my sister was like let's just go look. So we went and looked and it was fucking huge like so big. There was a walk-in closet and a really cute kitchen. And it's been up for a really long time, so I offered a little bit less than what they were asking for. And I want to sign a two-year lease because I'd like to stay somewhere for two years. Fingers fucking crossed. Because I haven't found anything else that I like, and this is the only one that I've like actually been excited about. Pray for me, please. As always, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in my next video.